Is Tomokyo born in Tonga? Yes, moved to uh, New Zealand when he was 10. There goes Clarsen. The offload, the space here. And Cockett is going to streak in the corner. And Rory Cockett, as he did in the top 14 final, finds the gap opening in front of him. And he gets the try, and it has come virtually from nothing. And that's a danger man sneaking down the short side. A pick from Clarsen. That comes as a direct result of a very, very dominant scrum. The scrum was turned the right way. As a result of pressure, blindside winger uh, Kev McLaughlin was stuck to the side of the scrum. Simple pick from, from the eight. Feeding nine, drawing Sorry, on the, line. the yeah, Leinster 14, uh, okay. Fergus McFadden, and a very, very simple try. Too simple. Well, I wonder if Serge Mias will be tempted to bring on Karina Wiongi at some point because the two props, okay, Tamopio and Wiongi, made mincemeat of uh, Clermont in the semi-final in the top 14 and then Toulon in the final, two powerful scrummages. But not only did they get the drive on, they got the angle correct in, in the scrum as well, and that makes all the difference. You could have got a drive on, yes, they would have got a penalty because they were in control of the scrum, but they wheeled that scrum slightly to the left. It meant that the blindside wing, it was blindside, um, wing forward was stuck to the scrum and then it was exploited simply in a two and one down the short side. Cockett from out wide, rarely misses two on the bounce. And all of a sudden, everything's going well. Look at this here, you'll see the left-hand side of the scrum get up a little wheel, turn. Actually, Lenser got a decent drive on, but they were almost suckered into it by Castor there. They got the wheel, and it opened up that short side, leaving first McFadden very, very exposed. Very difficult to do anything there for a winger. Nine points to seven.